Hi guys, 안녕하세요 여러분, 엔사입니다. How are you guys doing? As you can probably guess, I am freezing! It is... what date is it today? 6th of May. We are officially at the end of spring and it is still so cold in my apartment. They've turned down central heating in this entire building because apparently May is considered summer in the UK. Have they seen the weather forecast for the past 100 years or so? I kind of feel like this setup actually fits today's video because I will be very casually without having done any studying, even though I told you guys I would this April, but you know, life can do things to you. <laughs> so I found the latest topic one test that was given in October 2018. It is the 60th topic and I'm gonna take it right now in front of you guys and see how I do. I haven't studied. I have not seen any topic tests before. I am a complete blank slate of paper when it comes to topic. Originally I was planning to take this very very seriously and simulate the test environment as closely as I possibly could but then it got really cold and I got really cozy and I have some snacks here with me so I will adhere to the timings and not take any longer than is actually allocated for each section. You can download this test yourself completely for free either from the topic website or the topic guide website. I'll provide all the links in the description for your guys' convenience. So without further ado, I shall jump into the test. All right, 40 minutes timer set. I have my snacks here. Yeah. Let's get some energy before we start. These are some of my favorite Israeli snacks. And I was so surprised that I can find them here in the UK. Oh, so addicting. Hangul 
Well, so we so we have some, yeah. If you wanted to introduce, yes. And then. <laughs> Apparently this is what I had as the next track on my iTunes. I'm okay with that. <laughs> right, this was the whole 40 minutes of the listening section for topic one. I didn't even actually have to time myself because the entire listening track is fully timed so it just lasts for 40 minutes and you're done. So now we are moving on to the ilki or the reading. Oh, sorry guys, my SD card got full. Maybe a lot of footage to edit. All right. So this section I actually do need to time. Oh man, this is not a joke, guys. This is a tough test. Okay, one more hour. Let's do this. Topic one, reading section, without any practice. Let's go. Japanese. <laughs> 아침 7시에 일어납니다. 후. Sun's out. I'm getting so many ones. Ah. Okay. 어제 친구와 공원에 갔습니다. 저는 맛있는 김밥을 준비했습니다. Left and I am on question 61 out of 70. Oh my goodness, my back is dying. Oh. Two more. Number four for sure. Done! Okay, what is the time? 22 minutes earlier, I'm done. Oh. I know I should look over my answers, but I don't wanna. Okay. <sighs> Let's do this. Oh, I skipped one, so I need to go back to it. It's weird, because I'm understanding all of these passages, but then the options that they give you in the multiple choice are just so random and out of this world, like, Ugh, can't they just scan my brain and realize that I understood the passage pretty perfectly? Ugh. I know I'm gonna get 65 wrong, like that's happening. I'm just gonna change my answer from two to six. From, from two to six, ha! Huh? There's no option six. Um, from two to one and see how that's gonna go. I'm just gonna change my answer. I'm just gonna change my answer. Oh. Four, three, two, one. Okay. Done. Here I have all 70 answers. Let's download the answer sheet to check how many of these I got right and whether I actually passed this 60th topic one test without studying. To be completely honest, I am probably 70% confident that I passed, but anything can happen. In order to pass topic one with the first level, you just need 80 marks out of 200. But in order to pass topic one with a second level, you need 140 points out of 200. Each section that I just did is 100 points each. For some reason, the answer key is showing the ilgi or the reading section first, but okay. Let's see. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, so far in the reading section, I got two answers wrong out of 40, worth three points, and 65 was worth two points, which means I got 95 points out of 100 on the reading section, which kind of means that just with this reading section, I passed the first level of topic one, so. Technically, I didn't fail the test at all. Good. That's good to know. Moving on to the tukki section. Okay. Twenty-seven is three. Twenty-eight is one. Twenty-nine is four, and thirty is one. Woo! Oh my God! I got every single question. Correct. No way. That is true. I'm gonna check again. That is crazy. Okay, so that's a hundred out of a hundred and Overall, I got a hundred ninety five out of two hundred on Topic one Test without studying Wow, guys, I am sort of surprised, but at the same time, not surprised because I'm not aiming to take topic one. I'm aiming for topic two. I'm actually curious. Let's see which ones these are. What did I get wrong? 56. Oh my God, I was correct. <gasps> okay, guys, this is really annoying. So if you see right here, I was actually correct at first. I wrote two, then I scratched it out and I wrote a one. But in reality, it was actually a two. Oh, my first gut instinct was correct. Overall, this does make me happy and confident about the choice that I made to take topic two instead of topic one. Even though it doesn't cost a lot of money to take topic one, I just feel like it would be a waste of time probably and just brain energy to take both, even though I can and you can as well. If you are absolutely crazy and you wanna take two tests in one day, you can sign up for both topic one and topic two. I'm pretty sure they do them on the same day. Let me know if I'm wrong. But yeah, now I am more than ever motivated to actually start studying for topic two, maybe, do you guys think I should take topic two test without studying? How badly do you think I'm gonna do? <laughs> the writing section? Oh, I'm going to be terrible. I do not know how to formulate coherent sentences in Korean, so that is gonna be really fun. But let me know if you wanna see me take topic two without studying. And if there's anything else about topic that you want me to make a dedicated video about, please let me know as well. The comment section is all yours. Message me on social media. Reach out to me anywhere you want. All right, you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Annyeong.